Forex trading for beginners. Can you really make money? So before we get started, make sure to hit that like button. Also subscribe to my channel. What is Forex trading? FX or foreign exchange? Forex. Trading is the exchange of different currencies on a decentralized global market. It is one of the most widely traded markets worldwide. When trading Forex, you simultaneously buy and sell the world's currencies on this market. When you trade Forex, you trade in currency pairs such as CAD USD, Canadian dollar vs US dollar. The first currency of the pair is called the base currency, while the second is the counter currency. Based on the given example, in CAD USD, the base currency is CAD and the country currency is USD. You will then speculate on whether the price of one country's currency will rise or fall against another country's currency and take a position accordingly, either buy or sell. You will buy or go long if you think the base currency will rise against the counter currency. On the other hand, you will sell or go short if you believe the base currency will fall against the counter currency. If your speculation is correct, you will earn a profit. If not, you can make a loss. Technical Analysis versus Fundamental Analysis Just like you do when trading stocks, currency trading gets more precise when you know how to read charts. While it's not the most exciting part of trading, going through numbers is key to a successful trade. Without it, all you do is gamble. Again, like with stock trading, traders go through technical and fundamental analysis upon which they base their trading strategy. Let's quickly go over the difference between the two. To do technical analysis, you would look at the past performance of the exchange rate of currency pairs. Technical analysis is what you typically see in movies about stock traders, where they look at lines that go up and down. This is the market fluctuation, and the purpose of technical analysis is to predict where the market will go based on past performance. Fundamental analysis is concerned with a country's performance economy-wise as shown by economic data such as GDP, employment, and inflation. Of course, other indicators come at play such as government stability and the country's international political and trade relations. All in all, the fundamental analysis approach attempts to predict the country's currency value by assessing the country's well-being. So which approach of the two should you pick? It might come as no surprise that it'd be best to learn both methods. What you can do is learn how to do both and, using a demo account, test them separately and together. How to make money with Forex fast? The two things that new FX trader will ask is, how much money will I make from the Forex market? And how to make money fast on Forex? The saying goes that the easiest way to get $1,000 in Forex is to start with $5,000. This is a tongue-in-cheek answer but points to an issue that is not a joke. Many traders do lose money on Forex. Nevertheless, it is indeed possible to make money trading Forex. In fact, plenty of people manage to make a consistent income trading Forex daily, especially if they have an effective Forex day trading strategy in place. The fallacy is that it is easy money. Typically, when someone signs up to start trading Forex, they do so under the false illusion that it is an easy way to make money. They are sold on expensive courses that feature wealthy millionaires in their yachts, talking about how they do no work but make lots of money. That very well may be so, but it is highly doubtful that those same wealthy millionaires weren't working their butts off at some point in their life. It is also highly likely that those millionaires have lost a huge amount of money when starting trading Forex and learning how to succeed in what they do. That is the nature of the game. Learn trading terminologies. Before you start trading, you must have an idea about basic Forex terminologies such as pip, spread, margin, leverage, bear market, bull market, broker, bid, exchange, close, day trading, dividend, long trade, buy, short trade, sell, and blue chip stocks. Understand how to read Forex charts. To know what strategy you should use when trading, you should learn even the basics of Forex charts. There are three different options available when you use the MetaTrader platform when it comes to charts, line charts, bar charts, or candlestick charts. Choose the best Forex trading style for you. Trading can be your part-time or full-time work. Depending on your circumstance, 
You may choose to trade numerous times within the day for different lengths of time. You can choose between the following trading styles, currency scalping, intraday trades, swing trading, or position trading. Research and choose the best Forex broker. To start trading Forex, you should choose a Forex broker. Using a Forex broker, you can trade by buying a currency pair and close the strategy by selling the same pair or vice versa, depending on the market situation. Most Forex brokers allow foreign exchange transactions between numerous pairs of currencies for versatility. If you're not yet sure what strategies to do when you trade, most brokers will give you trade signals indicating the currency pair you can trade, what time you can trade, and if you should buy or sell the currency pair. Your broker will also often dictate which trading platform you should use. MetaTrader 4, MT4, and MetaTrader 5, MT5 are usually the apps used in trading. Because it takes skills to determine the best strategy in Forex trading, expect brokers to charge additional fees per transaction or a monthly fee for you to access their software and trading products. As time goes by, as you become more familiar with trading, you will also learn the basic strategies you can apply when trading. Learn the software, MT4, MT5, by using demo accounts. Since you'll be using trading software to open and close positions in trading, you should learn how to use them. To avoid losing your money, these platforms have demo accounts you can use to get the hang of knowing how to trade. Trading Forex can be overwhelming, but take it one step at a time until you get the hang of it. Make sure that you spend time being updated on the news, new strategies, and resources. And remember that you should only trade money you can afford to lose. Take it slow and steady. And as you become more aware of the tricks and trades of Forex trading, the more you can grow your money. If you plan on exchanging currencies or sending money, choose Remit B services. Our services are fast and safe. We also give you the best currency exchange rate to get the most out of your hard-earned money. What do you think about our video? Let me know in the comment section below. Before you go, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.